But it seems to me that this should be pushed through an AI read of PubMed, which already exists, right? Mm -hmm. Most of the large language models are trained on the entire internet, including yep. PubMed, and that it should point somebody in some actionable directions, including which of these groups, yep. I meant to ask this earlier, excuse me, which of the various groups for a given disease is the best one? Yeah, exactly. Like, like if somebody, yeah. this kid, you know, God forbid, has a, has a blood cancer, yep. which group do you go yeah. to? Is there a best one? Are these rated by anybody? I mean, I, I'm not trying to throw our, our arms around all of medicine here yep. and all of the problems in the world, but it seems to me that all of this is tractable. Someone just needs to get organized about the databases. I completely agree. I think that there's such randomness to, to healthcare and to our biomedical research system. I think that's probably maybe the, the most heartbreaking part of this all is that because it's so random, you know, Michael gets a drug and he walks his daughter down the aisle nine years later and a bunch of other people don't get a drug and they, they aren't alive. And so I, I, I love the idea of that centralized database.